first of all, thank you for uh, coming to speak to us after the game today. A disappointing result, of course, for Blues. You know, what were your thoughts on the performance as a whole today? Um, yeah, I think uh, everyone is quite disappointed, frustrated about the result. Um, we had um, a lot of chances uh, to score goals, but the luck wasn't on our side today. And um, but the positive on it, we created a lot of chances. Uh, we had 19, 19 attempts on goal, so it's um, it's good to have a lot of chances. But we need to score goals, and uh, we need to improve in that. Yeah, you mentioned the uh, the amount of chances, the amount of shots you had today. Do you think on on another day you get a better result here today, considering how you played? Yeah, probably. Um, on another day we will score probably. Two two free goals uh, more uh, but today uh, like I said uh, luck wasn't on our side and um, but we will carry on um, we will carry on uh, creating chances um, having shots of goal um, and uh, we will focus on the defense and um, yeah could see less goals um, a word on Troy Deeney he's had a very very difficult week of course but he's came here started the game and scored a goal from across that you put into the box how pleased were you for him to get that goal? No, uh, I thought Dini is a great lad. Um, I'm happy for him that he can uh, score a goal, um, especially after this week uh, he had behind him. Um, but um, our focus, uh, he was he was fully focused on football and to help the team, and he done it today. So uh, big credit to him. And of course, not the result you would have wanted coming back to play against one of your old clubs. Um, but with, a, with an assist and a ton of chances created, a ton of balls into the box, uh, how happy were you with your personal performance today? Um, yeah, I'm, I'm happy I could help the team with an assist today um, and create a lot of chances. Um, but I'm, um, yeah, I'm, not, I'm not really happy at the moment. I'm just frustrated about the result. And, uh, I can play good and still lose the game, but then if you play good, it's not it's not good enough for the team. Um, it's about the team. We need to win the games, and um, that's what I'm trying to do. Um, now it's a, it's a couple of frustrating results back to back. Um, how do you make sure you bounce back from this going forward? Just uh, get our mind right, um, get back, um, reassess the, the game and get focused for the next game, because uh, on Tuesday it's uh, Norwich away and uh, we need to be fully focused on that. Um, one positive is George Hall coming back into uh, back into the squad after a little while out with injury. How important do you think he is going forward for the rest of the season and how much you enjoy playing with him? No, George Hall is, um, is a good kid. Um, he's great. Um, he got his pace uh, for running in behind, uh, for stretch the play for us. and. Uh, now he's important, uh, and everyone else is important in the squad. Um, every player that we got, um, like we, uh, we said before, it's, uh, it's not an 11 man job, it's uh, the whole squad, it's, uh, everyone is needed. It was uh, a fantastic support once again from the travelling fans. How grateful are you for their support away from home? It's great. Um, their, their support has been, been unbelievable the um, whole season. Um, especially away games, uh, they've been there with us. They stick with us, and um, they hopefully they're going to stick with us, and um, so we can carry on uh, for the next season. And finally, it's a it's a very tight turnaround for the game against Norwich on Tuesday night. Is it a case of putting this result behind you and putting your full focus on that game? Yeah, we're getting back. We're gonna we're gonna have a meeting about this game and then put it behind us and focus on, uh, on Tuesday. Brilliant. Thank you very much. No problem.